Hey, what is going on, guys? I'm so with Beast, and I'm back here to bring you another video today. In this video, I found a level 5012 Iron Lancer on a 5 to 1 ratio. If you don't know what that means, it's when you divide the enemies a little by 5. That's the amount of stat points you all have to allocate. In this case, it's 5012 divided by 5, which is about 1002. Um, uh, so I just decided to go with 1000 because that's the stat allocation I've used for like the past three 5 to 1 fights. So that's what I went with uh, my typical 5 to 1 gear the Evit, Trahan, Dark Armor, Ring of Man, and uh, Maximus. So, um, this 5 to 1, uh, I was surprisingly tough. This guy, he's weird, you know, he switches speeds all the time, and, um, that was, that was kind of disorienting to see him switch speeds all the time. Like, I don't know. Um, he is probably the hardest staff enemy I've done a 5 to 1 on so far, except for, uh, Sadie. Sadie is probably the hardest one I've done so far. Um, we'll have to see with the eyeless knock, he's supposed to be really tough. Um... Dark Fiend, I don't find him very hard. Uh, Petrified Knock, pretty simple as well. So the only one left that I think can beat uh, this guy or Sadie would be the Eyeless Knock. Um, so because I find this guy and Sadie to be two hardest staff enemies, uh, just in my opinion. Even though this guy didn't take me that many tries. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, it, it wasn't that bad. Um, but this five to one, uh, definitely fun. Like all the other five to ones. I mean, I'm not doing them if they're not fun. Um, <laughs> And, um, so yeah, staff enemies, I'm finishing them off, I'm finishing off the ones I want to do, I don't want to do the easy ones, um, and there's not that, like, tons of staff enemies, so, because I've done Sadie, um, uh, Hornstalker, uh, Fell Siren, and what's the other one? I know I've done another one. I can't remember, I think I've done another one, I'm not sure, um, but, um, uh, so yeah, Iron Lancer, enemy you don't see a lot so I, I forgot about him you know I, I saw him in the hallway and I was like whoa who's that and then I, then I looked at his name and I was like okay I'll do a 5 to 1 on him because I remember him being a moderately tough enemy um, like I said I find the dual enemies to be the toughest enemies in the game but um, these enemies aren't aren't that bad of fighters so and of course sword and shields easy uh, god king um, I think he's a pretty tough enemy um, the MX Defender is probably the hardest sword and shield enemy next to the God King. Um, none of the sword and shield enemies are all that hard, except for maybe the God King. God King's still a pretty difficult enemy. Um, but uh, yeah, so staff enemies, after staff enemies, I don't know what I'm going to do because um, I want you guys to leave comments suggesting what enemies I should do after the staff enemies. Um, there are some dual enemies that I didn't do. I think there's two the Horned Witch. And um, there's one more, the Iron Lancer. No, that's what. <laughs> sorry, that's the guy I'm fighting right now. There's another dual guy. Um, I forget his name. He's one of the God King's minions. Um, so I don't remember his name. But anyway, those guys are like, those guys are really easy dual enemies. So I decided not to do them. And they're also not part of the God King Club achievement, uh, Leg Fighter Pro. So I was like, meh, not doing them. <laughs> but um, so yeah, after the staff enemies, I want to know what you guys want me to do. Uh, definitely leave a comment down in the description. Uh, or why do I keep saying description? I say that all. <laughs> I mean, comment section. Please leave a comment in the comment section, and I'll get to that. Um, what I'm looking at is probably maybe the big enemies. I mean, I've done MX Hulk. Um, I've done I don't know maybe a Moss Golem, but I don't know how to get his level. I know there's a formula for getting the levels of people. Uh, maybe I'll do Xyloto. He sounds pretty cool to do a 5 to 1 on. I just have to get the equation to get his level because he's a Sky Cage enemy, and if you didn't know the Sky Cage enemies, do not show you like a little level uh, before the fight so you can't really divide anything by 5. However, there is an equation that you can get their health and put their health, plug their health into an equation. I know, math. I just, I just got done with school. I don't want to deal with math. But, um, <laughs> but you plug out into an equation and you'll get a uh, level for that enemy. Now it's not completely reliable, but it's the best thing we can get um, because some enemies' healths differ on their level. So I don't know. It's not the best thing ever, but uh, it's the best thing we can get. So yeah, if I do get that equation, um, I will definitely try to do some five ones and sky cage enemies. That would also um, Torin or not Torin. Sorry, the Dark Fiend might be a cool. Why? <laughs> sorry guys. Uh, I don't know what I'm saying. I called the MX Enforcer. Um, the uh, Iron Lancer, now I just called the Iron Hunter uh, the Dark Fiend. I mean, the Iron Hunter, aka what you people used to call Torin, 
um, he uh, would be cool to do a 5 to 1 on. He's a sword and shield enemy, so I guess he would be in the sword and shield hard category. Um, I've done Rith. I mean, I've got to do Rith, man. He pulls views. <laughs> Rith, uh, he, ma he makes for views. Um, but yeah, 5 to 1s are actually dropping in views right now, so I'm not really sure if I'm going to continue after staffing staff enemies. Uh, so I guess I shouldn't have got your hopes up right there, but um, I might not continue after staffing these because five to ones are dropping um, And uh, so yeah, I'm not sure we'll have to see what happens But um, if you do enjoy the five to ones make sure to leave a like to encourage me to keep doing them because um, I'm getting to the point where I don't you know I say that but um tomorrow I'll probably say I love five to ones I want to do them again because that's what I flip-flop back on that mentality all the time so, um, but yeah, if you do enjoy these videos, these 5 to 1 videos, make sure to leave a like, like the playlist for the 5 to 1 videos. I do have a playlist with about 15 5 to 1 fights in it, uh, so make sure to like that as well. Make sure to subscribe to me, I am just hit 370, going for 400, and uh, so I've, yeah, I've been growing faster lately, um, so that's nice. Get about 100 subs a month, um, so yeah, that's cool. <laughs> I mean, iDroid gets like 500 subs a month, yeah, or no. Not 500, it's more than that. I don't know what it is. But anyway, that's it for this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed uh, this 5 to 1 on the Iron Lancer. Definitely a tougher one than the other staff enemies besides Sadie. But um, so, yeah, if you did enjoy, make sure to leave a like and uh, subscribe to my channel for some awesome Finny Blade content, including more 5 to 1s and other stuff. So, yeah, I'm just showing you my stats again. 1,000 stat points. Uh, yeah, 1,000 stat points allocated and uh, just showing you my equipment. But that's it for this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed. I'm Swords of the Beast, and I'm out.